do anything extra. Oh, I just broke it. Dang it. Look, look, look. Good morning and happy Monday. Welcome to another vlog. Hello. <laughs> Today is a very exciting day for multiple reasons. Honey, do you want to tell them why it's exciting? I start my new job. <laughs> and what are you doing at your new job? Carpentry. He is going back to being a chimney. <laughs> How exciting. Just so many answered prayers. If you didn't know, my husband is actually a carpenter by trade. But the past few years while we've been traveling and settling down into new towns, he has just found any job that he can in order to provide for our family. So now he is finally going back to carpentry and we're both just so excited. Anyway, I am currently making myself some breakfast. <laughs> And Ez just made himself some too. Made you a greens drink too. Yeah. A hungry boy. A hungry? Let's get you some food. <laughs> Come on. Thank you, darling. <laughs> Yummy. We have been eating basically paleo for the past few weeks, which is gluten-free, refined sugar-free, and grain-free. Most of our meals just consist of whole foods. So today we have boiled eggs with avocado and a little bit of sea salt. I'm actually doing a whole video on our diet change, so I won't say too much here, but so far we're loving it. I'm always feeling really full and really satisfied after I eat, so I'm excited for this. Are you excited? <laughs> you look so cute. <laughs> This opportunity is truly just such an answered prayer and something that God has just had his hand over and it's so evident and overall we are just both so grateful. Now I'm going to clean the kitchen. I'm just going to unpack the dishwasher because it is clean but it's full so I want to get some of our dishes from this morning back in so I need to have it on. Almost like a continuous cycle of as soon as it's done it needs to be emptied. So I'm going to do that. Today is Monday. I think I mentioned that at the start of the video. So we've just had the weekend and we had a lot of fun. On Saturday one of my beautiful friends had her baby shower and it was just such a lovely day celebrating her and her baby girl. And then on Sunday, so yesterday, we actually had some friends over for dinner which was so much fun but I also spent some of the day yesterday meal planning for the week ahead so I wanted to show you some of the things that I made. So I made some chia pudding. I prepped some veggies. This is just grated zucchini and carrot which is perfect for any dinner basically that we have throughout the week. I put all of our fruits and veggies into glass containers and I wash them all first obviously but I find that this just makes it so much easier to grab from the fridge. Then I also made some homemade mayo and also some homemade raspberry jam and caramel date sauce. These two are basically empty because I made a gluten free grain free refined sugar-free chocolate cake for dessert last night and we had some raspberry jam and some caramel sauce with it too which was super yummy so they are the things that I have prepped for the week I just love being prepared I love having healthy snacks that we can just quickly grab and it truly just brings me so much joy making things from scratch all of those have super healthy whole ingredients so they make you feel good when you're eating them too <laughs> has just gotten home from work so I'm currently cooking up his lunch he didn't get a chance to eat it today so I thought I'd make it for him now it's just leftovers from what we had for dinner the other night but it's so yummy this is sweet potato broccoli and ground beef here you go oh, yummy 
Ez got home from work today at 3.30 and he also left the house this morning so late as in after the sun came up which is so weird. I don't know it's just all so different but in a really good way. At his old job he would wake up at 2.30. He would have a super long drive. He would work for 12 hours and then he wouldn't get home till 6 p.m. So I'm just so grateful to have him home this early but he's currently in the backyard just fixing up a few things for his work day tomorrow. In the meantime, I made myself some chocolate cake. This was Ezra's serve leftover from yesterday and I just added some of the raspberry chia seed jam I guess it is. So kind of like a raspberry chia seed pudding and then some of that caramel date sauce as well and it is just so yummy. I winged the chocolate cake recipe. I just used almond flour, cocoa powder, eggs, maple syrup and coconut oil and it just turned out so yummy. So this is my little afternoon snack. Over the past few days we've made some little home decor improvements so I just wanted to show you what we've done. Hi boy! Hi there! <laughs> Oh, you got your toy. So we put some more baskets up on the wall. I thrifted a few more the other day, including this beautiful one, which I actually think is one of my favorites. And then just some other shapes up here, which I love. And then to this wall in our living room, we added this hanging plant, which I think looks so pretty. This plant is fake. I actually had it up in our last house back when we lived in Melbourne. And I really wanted to only have real plants in this house, but I wanted a hanging plant here just because I thought it looked so pretty beautiful however because we are renting a hanging plant would be too heavy for the type of hook that we have to use and we can't drill into the ceiling so I just put this one up for now but I think it looks really sweet and then something that I am so excited about is another Facebook marketplace pickup I have been searching for an outdoor table for the longest time I wanted one that was just super cheap mostly just to see if we'll actually use it and then maybe in the future we can upgrade to a bigger one but we found this table and chairs Set and I actually really love it. This is her. We got her table and all four chairs included for $30, which I think is so great. Do you like the table? But I love her so much. Unfortunately, I think it's still a little bit cold to be using it just yet, but I cannot wait for summer mornings and evenings out here. I think this will just be so beautiful to come out here and eat breakfast, and I'm so excited. The sun is about to set as part of our little pay paleo health challenge I guess that we're doing. We are going on daily walks which has been just so nice. It feels so good to get extra steps in and just get my body moving and I'm sure the same goes for Ezra and Rue. So the sun is about to set and I think we're gonna go on a walk now and then after that once we come home I'll probably just make some dinner and we'll have a quiet night. Do you want to go for a walk? Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> Yay! So for dinner tonight, I'm gonna do some taco bowls. We had these last week and they were just so yummy. And Ez has requested them again tonight. So all I use is some ground beef, lettuce, tomato, avocado, and capsicum. This capsicum is the size of my head. I make my own little taco seasoning for the mince. And then we've just been having it with some homemade mayo and some lime juice. And it's just been so lovely and nutritious and filling. So that's what I'm making. It's a very quick and very easy type of meal to cook. All you do is brown the mince and then add the seasoning, chop your veggies, and then you assemble it. I can't wait. This is so yummy. I always get so excited to cook slash meal plan or just making a meal in general I love. It is actually my favorite part of the day is when I get to come into the kitchen and make a nourishing meal for my family. It's my favorite. <laughs> We watched some YouTube and we ate our yummy dinner and it was just so cozy. 
It's now about 9 p.m. which is definitely my bedtime and it's time for me to do my skincare and brush my teeth and all of that fun stuff. So I thought that I would end the video here. This was such a sweet little vlog to film. It was just such a special day for us and so I hope you enjoyed watching. Thank you so much for being here. I love you so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye!